20 years on, the Bristol City heroes who famously ousted Liverpool from the FA Cup enjoyed a celebratory reunion with supporters at Ashton Gate. Brian Tinian's goal on January 25th, 1994 will live long in the memories of fans as well as the players from that night at Anfield. Obviously you got good days and bad days in football but that's definitely, um, that was definitely a good day. Uh, you had the two Wembley finals but I think playing at Anfield and winning at Anfield has got me the best in my career. Bad promotions here but yeah as a one-off game that was far and away. I mean obviously it wasn't exactly a one-off game because we played sort of two and three quarters but th that, that night at Anfield was special. They were a good side, they had some good individuals didn't they? I remember Steve McManaman being a, I think he was the same age as me but he was a, he was a top class player, we couldn't get anywhere near him on the night we were just saying and I thought we got hammered in the last game. I thought we played well in the first two games but, they, but there I thought we got hammered and we, we had to defend for our lives and I was just saying the two lads are well they defended on the night. It is a special night, obviously people remember a lot of things about the game but obviously to win at Anfield, the kit and everything else, it's like one thing you always remember in football and like, it's one thing I'll never forget. We played quite well in the first two games so we were confident of going up there and uh, we were doing quite well at the time so we had some big characters in the team as well who were you know, the older players and said I was the youngest member of the team but the older lads sort of said look we've got a chance here if we stick together and uh, played quite well on the night. So great to catch up with some old colleagues and obviously some old friends from around the place. But every time the FA Cup comes up every year, obviously um, when, I was a, when I was a younger child it was like um, Sunderland beating Leeds, everyone remembers that. And like, all the City fans remember like, uh, us winning at Anfield, so um, that's what brings clubs together, brings supporters together and obviously good members as well. While Tinian netted the winner, Liam Robinson could so easily have been the hero himself. In the first half he had an open goal to aim at, only to find the packed away end instead. You see little clips of, um, of the things that happened. Uh, you can see things from YouTube, you know, from the game that was previous to it, you know. And I think over the three games, you know, um, we did fantastically well and probably deserved to win. Um, yeah, and you know, matched them like you say. There were chances at both ends. Uh, you know, I know that they had a lot of chances, but we had some good chances as well. Uh, myself personally, I know I can think of one that springs to mind. But you know, stuff that that flashes through your mind and you watch it back and you think gosh you just scored there and things like that but um, yeah overall it's just fantastic. What went through your mind then when Grobelar finds you about 25-30 yards out? I seen somebody in the crowd I think it was somebody I knew and just decided to pass it to them and leave the net him to just I don't know have a good touch and, and hit it which is what I did but uh, I think um, going back to something like that an occasion like that your adrenaline is pumping you know at a massive rate and uh, I'm not making excuses, but probably just put a little bit much on it through to adrenaline and it just drifted over the bar. If we're talking about that one incident that we're, <laughs> I'm thinking about. As for Tinian, he admits he can still remember the Anfield victory like it was yesterday. It was a, it was a great night for everyone and if you were there, you'll never, you'll never forget it as a player with the boys tonight. All the fans who were there will never forget that night. Obviously playing against a club with a tradition of Liverpool, massive club. And the players they had, some quality international players. So, yeah, it was a, it was a really good night and ranks up there with the, one of the best moments of, of my career. They more than held their own. And of the chances, the best have clearly gone to Bristol City. Well, I remember the cup tie against Bristol Rovers, which Bristol Rovers took the lead. I was also in the ground for the York City Cup tie in the fourth round a few years ago when Keith Morwin had all the chances. Alisson now, inside the penalty area, surely the shot comes in! Oh, and it's there! 